What's up guys? Here is my review of the Amazon Fire TV. I'm turning the fan off because this uh, fan makes a lot of noise here. Um, I've been playing with this for a couple of days now and I, I tell you, I was having a hard time deciding between this or the regular Android TV. Um, I have the Android TV box upstairs on my daughter's TV. Um, and it's got, as you can see, um, we got, I got YouTube here, which I have YouTube on that one, but um, it's logged into a different account for my daughter. Um, I customized this, I got the music, I got video, photo, YouTube, you know, um, and everything like that. Up here at the top, let's see, let me go to the top. You got all these different um, settings. You got your home, you got live, you got your videos, you have movies. Um, wait, there's the movies. There's live shows and your apps and your settings. I think I kind of went through all that um, in order, but I'm not 100% sure, but it'll be okay. Um, but that's basically how it works. And you got all these different settings here. You have um, your networks, sound display, app, uh, applications and stuff like that so on remote Alexa um, and all this other stuff right here you would link your this is where you would go in and link your um, Amazon account for those that um, has it to where when Amazon ships it to you it's not linked but um, when you order it on Amazon, you can have it automatically linked to your account and there's nothing you have to do here when you go through that process. Uh, I'm gonna hit the home button and it just takes me right back home. You can tell Alexa to open something. Alexa, open YouTube. I couldn't find any enabled videos here. Go to the Alexa app to find and enable... Okay, the I got device. other Alexa devices. Open YouTube. Alexa. Open YouTube. Okay, so that time it read me. Okay. Somebody's been... My, my daughter's been down here playing on YouTube. So... Um, this is just an ad between a video that I can just hit the back button. So, all right, so um, she just has all she tries to watch her videos on YouTube online and uh, everything. The reason why I have two accounts is so they don't really sync up uh, with the videos she watches, but it does it anyways. Um, there is a video that she watches and I watch, which was the one that was previous playing. Um, I got a lot of people talking about cruise information for like cruises and the um, shutdown for uh, now for the uh, pandemic and everything like that. So um, you can just scroll on through YouTube, the, the things here and all this stuff right here is a mixture of mine and hers, which I try my best to not have that happen, but you know, it is what it is. Can you tell a five, uh, not five, can you tell a seven year old not to mess with your TV and then expect her to completely listen? No, it's not possible. Um, but anyways, Alexa, go home. All right, so now, you have live TV, which is through uh, Pluto right here. Um, it's free. 
Alexa, open Pluto TV. Hmm, I have a few skills that can help. Could you mean DTC TV? No. Alexa, respond on the correct device. To whom? <laughs> yeah, so, so if you guys have... There's no incoming call. I'm not talking about any incoming calls, Alexa. Anyways, go go home. Go to bed. Alexa, turn off the lights and go to bed. I didn't catch the other thing you said. Alexa, go to bed. That's what I thought. Alexa, turn on the lights and let's resume. Lights doesn't support that. I know lights don't support that. Alexa, please turn on the lights. And as you can see, I said, Alexa, please. And she did it. That's cool. Okay, so, Alexa, open Amazon Music. I couldn't find any enabled video skills. Don't make me disable you back there. I'm to hey. I'm talking to you over there. Don't make me come back there. Because you won't like me. So here I come. Don't respond to me. Muting you. I mute you too. Okay, let's get back over here and let's get back into this. Okay, so let's see. Alexa, open Pluto TV. And as you see, it's opening Pluto TV, and you have all kinds of channels here. I mean, you have a lot. And I heard that if you activate right here, then you would get a whole lot more. Um, but I'll just sit here and scroll. And watch how far, this is how many is on here right now, without me registering. I mean, it's just going, and going, and going, and going, and going, and it stops. Anyways, Alexa, let's go home. See, you can sit there and say, Alexa, let's do this. It says, yeah. <laughs> Alexa, go home. <laughs> it's so fun. It is so fun. Okay. Alexa, open YouTube TV. Here's YouTube TV. Okay, as you see, I don't have it set up. I don't have a YouTube TV account, but my brother does, and I'm telling you, he loves it. I'm, um, I'm, uh, YouTube TV has right now where you can uh, subscribe and get live TV shows up. To, I want to say right now it's like 85 or 75 channels on YouTube TV for $50 a month. And that is for, um, I want to say the lifetime of the account. If the chart price has changed, I'm not 100% sure if the price is will go up on you or not because you might be grandfathered in so that's just a um, thing to take in consideration I got hiccups I'm trying to hold it under my breath <laughs> anyways Alexa what are you doing I'm here ready to answer your questions that's a cool little response on the screen there for saying that Alexa let's go home Alexa, let's go home. Let me see if my uh, cable box for DirecTV is on. Alexa, turn on DirecTV. Did you mean TV? Yes. Let's see what it is. No, I didn't say turn off the TV. Alexa, turn on TV. Alexa, turn on the TV. Th 
as you can see it turns on TV I have a Samsung smart TV and um, it has a lot of internet stuff built into it but it's not nowhere good nowhere as good as this um, you have the ID channel Alexa open ID Let's see what it does. No. Alexa, let's go home. Is that... Alexa, open ID, go. Hmm. I have a few skills that can help. Do you need to go talk radio? No. Here's what I found. I said no. Alexa, go home. And as you can see here, um, Alexa will... Be quiet. <laughs> so, as you can see, when you say the A word, um, and you say something, sometimes she will respond correctly, sometimes she will respond sarcastically, which is so funny, because you can sit there and say, Google, do the same thing. Like, hey Google, you're so stupid and smart. Watch this. It ain't, it's, Google ain't going to respond to me. Hey Google, you're smart. You've just made it official. You just made it official? Do you mean we're married to Google? Oh my gosh, let's run, let's get out of here. Anyways, uh, let's get back to what we're doing. Um, so, let's see, let's see if I do this. Alexa, go to my movies. Let's see. Yep, yeah, it pulled up the movie tab. It's hard for me to see the small words at the top of the screen because my uh, vision, guys. So sometimes I have to get close. Um, but as you can see, as you can see here, um, it, it's got all kinds of movies on here. And these lines, let's see, I'm just going to choose a line. I'm going to go to this one. These lines, watch. They just go forever. There's the end of that one. Let's see, they will go to the end of this one. And it just goes and goes and goes and goes and goes and goes. Yay, 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 into the end. Alright, Alexa, let's go home. Go home. Sorry. I don't know that. You don't know that? It's a skill you might like. It's called Cat Translator. Want to try it? No. It's playing a, a little um, trailer video of that uh, the video that I'm on. So let's just go back up to the top and stop that. Alexa, go home. Okay, so as you can see, we're back on the home screen. And... You got all these apps. These are the recent. So you have, I will recommend you guys to download a speed test on your Alexa device. Um, smart TV, I mean, uh, Fire TV, whether it's the stick, the cube, uh, 4K stick or whatever. So let's go in here and let's see what my speeds are on the uh, speed test for right now. And as you can see, it is on the download speed and it is getting, I mean, it's, I'm getting pretty good speeds. We're paying, we got AT&T Fiber. All right, guys. And we're paying for 300 megs, approximately. Um, Wi-Fi, we don't get nowhere near that. And on Ethernet, we get way above, we get a little above 300 megs. Upload speed is 208. Um, there's been times where I've been on like 250 on the upload, which is pretty insane. Um, anyways, Alexa, let's go home. Alexa, go home. So I do recommend downloading that app now this app this row right here is all your 
applications as you can see there's not I don't have many on here and you can got you got on this row you got uh, on this end over here on the left you have all apps so you can click that and you can view all your apps that you have installed and everything so let's see we'll go back all right and so you have the all apps on that side like i was saying and if you go all the way to the other side again instead of having to go all the way back over to the opposite side to click on all apps you have all apps right there on the end too and it takes you to the same spot now that is pretty cool i like i really like that now let's see what else can we do um oops let's get off of that you have i mean you have so so much there's et live i guess that's the et channel I don't think that's installed. Let's click on it. Police officer. Yes. The video aired at 5 p.m. yesterday on Viacom C. Okay, so that that must be powered by Pluto because Pluto TV is the only TV service I have set up on here um, for now. Which I mean, to have the ET channel on here, that is. For free, that's pretty awesome. Um, you do have on Pluto TV. You have MTV, which is really cool because there's a lot of say Direct TV or ATTU verse or Comcast um, plans that you got to be on a certain plan to even get um, MTV and stuff like that. Let's see what we do now. Let me see if I can get her to turn on my uh, cable box. Alexa, turn on satellite. Okay, so as you see, I got a response with a dinging. I uh, disabled it saying okay after everything. So the um, cable box is on from DirecTV. So you can say something like, Alexa, Switch to satellite. As you see, it pulls up satellite TV and it's on a commercial. So, Alexa, go home. So, as you see, it responds to you. It tells you what input you're on um, and everything. It switches different. Um, inputs. I have an Xbox. Um, I have a soundbar here underneath the TV. I don't have it all set up with um, to, with her, Amazon Alexa. It didn't respond. It didn't respond because I kind of broke it out. <laughs> that was cool. I was wondering if it would do that because I could sit there and say something to Google and it'd be something totally off the wall. And like, uh, how do how do I say that? I I say a instead of hey, and it thinks I'm saying hey Google. But anyways, I said it low so it didn't respond. <laughs> but anyways, sorry, I didn't understand. Oh, she did. She did hear me. Oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. <laughs> I'm trying, guys. I'm trying to have fun. Anyway, um, so we're on our uh, movies. It looks like these are what me and my girlfriend has uh, put on a list. So any time you go into like your movie list or say uh, just click on this all right and then you s select is it on there add to a uh, watch list I, don't, uh, I guess that's what that is but that's normally where it is um when you do that i'm gonna go back up 
top. It will put it on, oh, come on. It will put it on this top row list right here. The um, second row right here is movies we have bought. Uh, as you can see, we haven't really bought many movies from Amazon. I wish I have because I can't tell you how many how many movies we have bought like DVDs and um, my girlfriend Amanda she would lose them and she's disabled just like I am but she's I'm, uh, she is uh, a little bit different she had a brain tumor when she was six so I understand her situation and I'm not sure if I'm blocking the TV, I just realized. <laughs> um, I'm going to come over here to the left side of the TV. But anyways, she had a brain tumor when she was six. And she's a little on the slow side. I don't 100% do not judge her for that. We're all human. Um, we all have our issues. And... We do our best, y'all. I mean, you have to do your best on what you can do. But anyways, we have this app right here, which honestly, I don't know how to pronounce that. I have a hard time pronouncing words sometimes. And then you have Tubi. Is that Tubi? Is that how you pronounce that one? Um, let's see if Tubi is installed. No, it's not installed, but he, let's see here. We're going to click on this. This is pretty cool, y'all. You got, I mean, it, it does just like Google. You click on the app, you click on the pictures, and then you just scroll through the photos and see what all it allows you to do. I mean, look at this. I mean, that is just really cool really cool and awesome but um to be i'm thinking about getting not this first one like i was saying i don't know how to pronounce i want to click on that and it looks like it gives you more movies and movies and movies and movies and it just look at this it just goes i mean i'm just holding the I'm over button. It's just going and going and going. <laughs> There's the end of it. Anyway, guys. So, to get it to jump back like that, um, like I just did to the very beginning of that roll, which I didn't know you can do that, you um, hit your back button on your remote. And that was that was cool. I didn't know that I can do that. And then this right here is the new Fire TV remote. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. Um, it's $29 if you have the, um, if you have the old remote, it's $29 on Amazon. Um, and it controls the volume of your TV. I don't know if you can see on the left side here where it's changing my volume. I'm going up and down. It will also mute your TV and, and everything. Now, this that I ha have displaying on the screen is the Fire TV Cube. I will link to it down in the description, and I can link to this remote right here as well. <clears throat> oh my gosh, I don't know what that was. That, that hurt. I um, kind of hiccuped, and it, it's like I have stomach problems, y'all. And... Some days I have good days, some days I have bad, but it's okay. Um, so you can find like movies like this. Um, Alexa, friends with benefits. Here's what I found. So it finds the movie and puts it on the right. Um, Alexa, Titanic. Here's what I found. I wonder if it... Okay, so that second one... Well... I guess these are all? I don't... 
It's got all kinds of movies of the Titanic. I gotta show Amanda that. Cause she would like that. That's cool. So let's see, is this free? Yeah, we can watch it. It says Titanic 2. Huh? Is, is, is there, is there, guys, is there a Titanic 2 out there? Let me know in the comments uh, below the movie. Because if this is a movie, then we're going to, I'm going to have her watch it. That's cool. And then I guess this. Still saying Titanic 2. That's cool. Alexa, travel. Here's what I found. Let's see what it said. It found number travel. Oh, that's awesome. That is so cool, y'all. Let me get back over here. I'm gonna sit on this little bed. That way I can stay out of the way. Here, guys. Now, I know it's kind of getting long on this video. Um, but. I don't have introducing a new way to watch news on Fire TV. This is an ad. People complain about these ads, but I I don't I don't mind them. Just ask. Alexa, play the news. Try it today. That's pretty cool. So when you do what it says, Alexa, play the news. So it pulls up that that it was just advertising. And then you got all these different networks that you can watch the news from. That is, that's cool. I won't have to explore that a little bit more. Alexa, Amazon mu Music. Oops, hang on. Let's, let's do what I was going to do first. Alexa, Amazon Video. So it just takes you to that. Let's just select. Alright, so there's the Amazon Video. Now this basically is the same stuff that scrolled across the top. This is... A little bit cleaner I guess um, it don't it don't scroll as fast as the other one so if you don't like that fast rapid scrolling this is a lot slower as you can see I'm holding the button down and it's just slowly going and it's just going and going and going. So hitting the back button on the rolls Not too many. does take it back to um, the front of that roll. Now you do have all kinds of options here. You have channels. You have your, you have channels here, which is you can get channels directly through Prime. Um, which is all these right here, Star, Cinemax, um, HBO, and all that, and it's pretty cool. Um, let's see, what is that? Let's see what this, let's see what that is. The other kids make fun of them because Okay, so that's a movie. Anyways, let's see. I don't know. Let's go back up to the top. Let me finish. So right here, you have categories. And this is all the categories on the Fire TV. Which is pretty awesome if you ask me. So let's just say... We're going to go to that one. Let's see what it is. Because I didn't go past that. So it... It zooms. 
Why is it zoomed through that? I mean, look at this. Well, that, wow. Okay, so the faster, if you just rapidly press the um, down button, you can get it to go through there pretty fast. So let's see. Uh oh. Okay, so there's categories. There's your library videos or whatever. Um, and it's got your list. It's got your list at the top here. Um, I have Ultraviolet on DVD. I was asking Amanda that I said, I, I have this movie. I know I have this movie, but I couldn't remember if I bought it on like demand or got the DVD, which I need to actually go and look for it. Um, find all my DVDs, I guess. I mean, I, I guess I can play DVDs through the Xbox. I have the Xbox One S. I've never played videos through it. And then here on the very, very end, on the right hand corner, you got your settings. Um, you really, really can't do nothing in this app with any of these settings. Why? Why it's there, nobody knows. But guys, I'm not gonna keep rattling on here and uh, wasting time. But as you can see, you can do a lot. Let's see what the Amazon app. Is this the shopping, is this actually the actual shopping app? It looks like it. Well, I don't know. That's cool. So let's go on back to the home screen here. And guys, if you made it this far, I really, really appreciate it. Um, please subscribe to my channel. Give my channel a thumbs up. Um, comment below on what you think and um, what I missed out. And um, I hope to see y'all in my next video. Again, this is the Fire TV Cube 2019 edition. So um, it is really, really awesome. But guys, again, I appreciate it. And uh, subscribe and like my channel, like my videos, and it helped me out so much. I will be linking to the Fire TV Cube second generation, the uh, new Fire TV remote, and I will link to the device that I am using to connect this to Ethernet instead of using the one that came with it because the one that came with it is not that fast of speeds. Anyways, guys, have an awesome day, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.